Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the directed antenna. So from the name only you can say, so there is some particular direction in which the signals will go. So that is nothing but the directed antenna guys. So these are the antennas having a particular direction specified for receiving or sending data. So both for sending data as well as for receiving data, there is a particular direction. So only in that direction you can send the data or receive the data. Okay, so assume that this is an antenna, so it is having a range like this, guys. So anything inside this range, it can take or it can receive or it can send the data. So the best example for this is nothing but our TV dishes, guys. So if you recall, like when you established or when you in initialized your dish, so most of you are using this, I know that. Okay, yes. So at that time, you will be fixing it in one particular direction, right? I don't know how I need to draw it. Okay, so it will be something like this, right? I don't remember it exactly. Okay, yes. So it will be in this way, right? A dish will be there and it will be pointing towards a one particular direction, right? Yes. So because the direction that the satellite will be giving the signals is fixed. So that is the reason why you will be establishing it into that direction and you will be leaving it forever, right? So did you ever change the change the direction, guys? No, because these are some type of geo geo satellites. We'll be discussing about them in detail, don't worry. So these satellites will be moving along with the earth, guys. So how your earth is moving, so at that speed only, at that rate only, they will also move. So that is the reason why both of them will be facing the same direction forever. So there is no need of changing this dish always. Okay, yes. So only in some particular direction, you can receive and send the data. So that is nothing but the directed antenna. Okay, the next type is nothing but sectorized antenna. So here from the name you can say, so there is some concept of sectors, right? Yes. So the, yes, you are right. So here we will be using the concept of sectors. So we will be dividing our area into sectors and based on that area, we will be dividing the signals, guys. Okay. So several directed antennas can be combined on a signal pole to convert, sorry, to construct a sectorized antenna or a cell can be sectorized into for an example of three or six cells. So basically here is our antenna, you can say, or here there are three different antennas also, you can say. Okay, so this antenna is sending the, sorry, this antenna is sending the signal to this and this is sectorizing the whole signal in this whole area. Similarly, this antenna is also sending to this and this is uh, occupying this area. Similarly, this area also. So in this way, the, using a three sector concept, we are occupying this much area, we are able to send our particular signal guys, our particular data. Similarly, the same process can be done in using six sectors also. So here it, it will be looking like a flower, you can say, right? Yes. So this type of dividing them into sectors and all those things comes under the sectorized antenna guys. Okay. Yes. So let us continue. The last type is nothing but the diversity antenna. So diversity. So it is a bit different, you can say, or it is a bit diverse. So it is in simple words, you can say it is a combination of the previous four antennas. guys. So grouping two or more antennas together is known as a diversity antenna. So it increases the strength of receiving and sending the signal. Yes. Yes. So I hope everyone got some basic idea about the types of antenna. So we discussed about three types in this lecture and we discussed the previous two types in the last lecture. So we are now clear with all five types, right? Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on this. So in the next lecture, we'll be discussing about the signal propagation guys. Okay. Yes. So let us meet in the next lecture. Thank you. Thanks for watching.